please welcome the judging panel from Britain's Got Talent. The ultimate prize for the winner of Britain's Got Talent was a performance on this very special show, a performance before royalty on the most prestigious variety show on television. After a horrendous first day of auditions, where the one highlight was a dancing pig, <laughs> I thought we'd all get beheaded. And then, a very nervous-looking mobile phone salesman shuffled onto the stage, and I sighed, and I thought, here we go again. Now, I must admit that I perhaps unfairly form the opinion that when they were dishing out talent, he was probably at the back of the queue. And then when he announced he was going to sing opera, well, we all cringed inside, wondering what timeless classic he was about to mangle beyond all recognition. <laughs> then he opened his mouth, and much to all our surprise, he had the voice of an angel. I couldn't believe it. The audience erupted in spontaneous applause, and, of course, I burst into tears. You're always <laughs> bursting into tears, Amanda. <laughs> now, I've never been particularly good at admitting I'm wrong, but I am happy tonight to create history. I was wrong. Good. <laughs> now, of course, that was Paul Potts, who went on to become the deserving winner of the whole competition. Since then, it's been the most incredible success story for Paul. His first album has already sold over two million copies, and he's been number one in 15 different countries. Britain has got talent. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm very proud to introduce Paul Potts.
Amen.